Hi, everyone. Thanks for joining us for Arc Salt Lake, where we cover everything authentic, relevant, and community-based. I'm Jamie McGriff, joined by Brian Schnee and Sean Kelly. And uh, we also have a special visitor. We sure do. Henry, come here. Come here. Come say hi. You're being a good All boy. Right. Come here. Give me a hug. National Pet Day here. Right. It's always buzzing, and Henry is in the house. And we need Henry to turn this way so we can see I know. his Henry, face. Show, him, show him all the good sides. He's not going to do it, but uh, you know, we'll try it. <laughs> no. Uh, well, more and more people have fur babies nowadays. Forbes reports pet ownership in the U.S. has spiked in the last 35 years. 56% of households owned a pet in 1988. You know what that number is right now? 66% own a pet in 2024. So nearly 87 million households. Don't let him eat the Yeah, bread. right? No, he was just giving it a sniff, right? Well, nearly 87 million households. Dogs are the most popular, 65 million. And cats next at 46.5. He's really excited about that. You know that. what? You should tell everybody what kind of dog is Henry. Henry is a golden doodle. So I'm, you know, he's hypoallergenic. Look, he's getting the pets there off camera right now. Um, I actually got him in, in Austin, Texas from a, a family that was looking for a home. Uh, they, they weren't able to be very active and, and so they wanted, you know, someone to raise him where they can go swimming and hiking. So that's exactly uh, what I did. So I'm very fortunate to, to have him. Got him when he was one years old. But going back to this, the third most popular pet is freshwater fish, then birds, then small animals like gerbils and rabbits, and then reptiles. Millennials are the biggest pet owners, making up 33%, followed by Gen X, baby boomers, and then Gen Z. An overwhelming 97% of all pet owners say they consider their pets as family, of course. Yeah, absolutely. Have you trained up Henry to be a caddy on the golf course yet? Not yet. I have taken him golfing, and he kind of just circles around me, and he... He just likes, he's just he, happy to be does there. He does he give it? you enough space so you can take a good swing? <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah, watch yeah, that, that back was, swing that's there. My, I was wondering. That's, that's what Henry, gets seven me iron. a little nervous. Yeah. Seven iron, Henry. I got to be able to, yeah. So let's play a little, little a little game here for National Pet Day, guys. We've asked our fellow anchors, reporters, meteorologists, everyone here at the station to send some photos of their pets to us. What are you eating, Henry? It looks like oh, a plastic a leaf. He's oh, doing gosh. a stretch. There's a plastic leaf. He's he, yeah. All right. Stay here. There you are. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so our producer put uh, these pictures together, and we have to guess who owns the pet. So we know Henry already belongs to Sean. So the first pet that we're looking at here is a given because uh, the person who's sitting next to me owns this particular dog. Oh, also a member of the family. Can you guess? Oh, easy. Yeah, Barley's eight, and I uh, should have brought Barley in. Barley right. and Henry would actually, as part of the Poo family, they would have been just fine. Hanging out, loving life. Chilling eight years old, huh? Yeah. Okay, so the next dog, this is a given. Everybody knows Francis. Francis belongs to our meteorologist, Chase Thomason. Just sunbathing there in that picture. Francis is famous literally nationwide. He is his videos have gone viral. Oh, yeah, Francis is especially viral in the winter and time. Familiar with the camera. Mm -hmm. especially dad in dad the winter gets time. Francis working the camera pretty good. Yes. So who owns? Bless you. <laughs> and he's just lying down. See, Can this we, is what this is what life is all there. about, there right go. here. There we go. All right. Yes. He is giving us a show. Thank you, Henry. <laughs> <laughs> Henry, make some room for Mr. Holland. Oh, man. Who owns Mr. Holland? <laughs> All right, what do we question. got next? All right, any guesses? Well, there's a newborn in the picture. Okay, so this is a, a rabbit. <laughs> Kristen. Ding, 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 yeah, ding, ding. Yeah, that's my guess. KK. Okay, we have a rabbit. All right, so now we're moving on to Clarice, Clarice and, and Stanley. Stanley. Oh, boy, this is tough. This, I would say, is probably Trent. Cats. I think so. Yes, All right. oh, Trent. Good that was good, Jamie. Oh, no. Trent and I send each other funny videos from time to time of cats doing all kinds of stuff. And uh, Trent has a tuxedo cat and a tiger cat, if you will. So uh, these two are really cute. And yes, we're, we're big cat people. Ooh. Oh, this is a tough one. I, okay. didn't, I didn't know we had someone here who has horses. Belle and CR. Um, uh, let me think about this. Uh, maybe our uh, 
And this is an on-air person? Is that, Mary is that, Nichols? It's either that or it's going to be... Um, Kristen McPeak. Kristen, All right. okay. okay. Kristen McPeak. That's awesome. Has horses. Awesome. Okay, and then we have oh, Alfredo I love these names. and Macaroni. I know who owns these two cats. Those belong to our Mary Nichols. There we go. Okay. Yes, Mary Nichols. And I believe they were adopted as well, rescue pets, I think. So uh, they're they're really really cute. Henry, you want to stay over here? Or yeah, uh, he's sniffing around. He's, he's got to figure out what else his... goes on down here. Those cats are 15 years old. And they're 15 old. years old. Yeah. Okay. So Mary's cats are 15 years old and doing well. Yes, I know. I smell like coconut because I just put on some cocoa butter. <laughs> All right. So this is Wally and Doug, the two dogs you see there. I have no idea who Wally and Doug may belong to. Uh, maybe, okay. All right. Uh, Laura Murray. Yeah. So there we have it. Folks. That's cool. Yeah. So Fresh living in the mix here. We are in their house right now. Yeah, we are. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we have another uh, pet. This is Oreo. Oreo. Yeah, I saw Oreo today. I, this is, I know this one. Any guesses? I gave Oreo a big, big squeeze. Friendly dog. I have no idea. No, I don't either. Amanda Jim? Gilbert. Oh, okay. Oreo, yes. Okay. Oreo's very sweet. We said hello outside today. All right. Yeah. Hi, Oreo. <laughs> All right, and so that is our pet segment. But of course, Henry is going to be hanging out with us. In He's the a, house. He is our honorary uh, yeah. guest. Get him a mic. We probably see him from time to time. Hey there. So, oh, 